the first 15 or so moves of our Crane 108. So we're going to continue working on that. We'll just go over the first 10 to make sure everyone's got those down, and then we'll move on to the next couple of ones. Yes, ma'am. Let's start with our five animal salutes. Attention stance. Yes, ma'am. Stand tall. Yes, ma'am. Five animal salutes. Five animal salutes. Two tigers hide their trail. Two tigers hide their trail. Then we're going to just step back with our right foot. Cross your right over left. Circle out, back fist, hard and soft. Hard and soft. Make sure you chamber your hands. And then we're going to step with our right, cross with our left, and pivot. So we want to be on, uh huh, perfect. And then step into our horse. Crane walking. Crane we're walking. walking. Then we're going to shift into a bow stance. Yep. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Descending arm, and waist. Make sure your front leg is bent. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Bring your right or left hand in and then cross open. One finger asks a question. One finger asks a question. So your left hand is going to be right up by your temple and then your right hand's pushing down. Perfect. Step back with your left. And crane wing punching. Crane, crane wing, wing punching. punching. Outside block with your right. Grab and push out. Fist through the sleeve. Fist through the sleeve. Hard and, and soft. soft. Hard and soft. Step to your left. Step soft. with your right. Pivot. And step to your horse. Crane walking. Crane, crane walking. walking. Make sure you're on horse pants. Arm, hand, and waist. Arm, hand, and waist. Bring your right hand in. One finger asks a question. One finger asks a question. Step back with your right. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching. Outside block with your left. Fist through the sleeve. Fist through the sleeve. Feet together. Yes, ma'am. All right, let's run through that two more times. Attention stance. Yes, ma'am. Stand tall. Yes, ma'am. Step back with your right. Hard and soft. Hard and soft. Crane walking. Crane walking. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Descending arm, hand, and waist. One finger asks a question. One finger asks a question. Step back with your left. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching. Outside block grab, fist through the sleeve. Fist through the sleeve. Hard and soft. Hard and soft. Crane walking. Crane walking. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Make sure you point your chest towards the mirror. So turn your, mm hmm good. And then push out, yep. One finger, ask a question. One finger, ask a question. Step back with your right. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching. Make sure you're making a straight line with your arm. Good. Fist through the sleeve. Fist through the sleeve. Feet together. Yes, ma'am. All right, one last time together. So step back with your right. Hard and soft. Hard and soft. Crane walking. Crane walking. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Descending arm, hand, waist. One finger asks a question. One finger asks a question. Step back with your left. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching. Fist through the sleeve. Fist through the sleeve. Hard and soft. Hard and soft. Crane walking. Crane walking. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Descending arm, hand, and waist. One finger asks a question. One finger asks a question. Step back with your right. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching. Fist through the sleeve. Fist through the sleeve. For our next move, we're going to step in with our right foot to a cat stance. Inside block with our right and peck out with our left. This is called a crane pecking. A crane pecking. Then set your right foot down. We're going to step 
into a tap stance in our left. Inside block with your left, peg out with your right, revise the crane. Revise the crane. And set your left foot down, lift your right knee, and we're going to have crane wings on this one. Flying crane. Flying crane. Make sure you lift your knee up high right in front of you. Okay, in front of you. Good. Perfect. Feet together. Ma'am. Yes, please. All right. So let's just start from right here. Fist through the sleeve with our left hand pushed out. And then we're going to step in with our right. Inside block. Peck out. A crane pecking. A crane pecking. Set your right foot down. Get on the ball of your left foot. Inside block. Peck. Revise the crane. Revise the crane. Set your left foot down. Lift your knee. Flying crane. Flying crane. Oh, good knee. Yes, good. Then we're going to bring our hands right out in front in crane beef. Mm -hmm. Hungry crane stands on one leg. Hungry crane stands on one leg. Reach back with your right foot and your left hand. And then we're going to swing them both forward. Hit our foot, come down, and up. Hungry crane, tap your strip. Hungry crane, tap your strip. Good, feet together. Yes, ma'am. Let's start again from fist through the sleeve. And then we're going to go up. What is it? Paint. A crane pecking. A crane pecking. Revive the crane. Revive the crane. Oop, we want to have our left foot on the ball. Good. Mm -hmm. Flying crane. Flying crane. Good. Hungry crane stands on one leg. Hungry crane stands on one leg. Reach back with your right foot, left hand. Swing it forward. Hungry crane capture shrimp. Hungry crane capture shrimp. And in this last one, we're in a bow stance, so we should have our right leg bent, back leg straight. Make sure you bend your front knee. Bend your front knee. Good. And feet together. Yes, ma'am. All right. Who thinks that they could do that on their own? You want to lead it? Yes, ma'am. All right. So I was going to lead you. Here's the stance. Yes, sir. Stand tall? Yes, sir. Or is it and soft? Soft. soft. Crane walking. Crane, Crane walking. Descending arm, hand, and waist. Descending arm, hand, and waist. One finger ask a question. One finger ask a question. Crane wings. Crane wing punching. Crane wing punching.
Okay, out. Back out. Mm -hmm. um, revive the crane. <laughs> and then set your left foot down. We're going to bring our knee up. Flying crane. Flying crane. Good. Then reach back with your right foot and your left hand. And then we're going to just go right across the top of our shoelaces as we come down. Good. And then we want to bring our hands up at a diagonal. So I want you to imagine that you're striking feet together. I want you to imagine that you're striking Bob over there. Okay, Bob's our mannequin. So if we did our hungry crane capture shrimp and just went straight up and Bob was standing right here in front of us, would that hit him? Yeah. Do yes. you think it would? Yes, because if he's standing right in front of us? Wait, this will hit here. Good. So yeah, we can strike. We can do our strike to the chin, to the solar plexus. Our lower hand might be going for bladder or groin. But we want to make sure that as we come up, we're coming up at a diagonal. Because the person's going to be right in front of us, right? So for those watching at home, if I just go straight up and someone's standing right in front of me, it's probably not even going to hit them. So we want to make sure that as we're coming up, we're coming up at a diagonal. Does that make sense? Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. Perfect. All right, so let's try those moves one more time, just our new moves before we bow out. So start with your fist through the sleeve, and then a crane. Pecking a crane. Pecking! Revive the crane. Revive the crane. Make sure you're on the ball of your left foot. Not your right, left. Good. Flying crane. Flying crane. Flying crane. Hungry crane stands on one leg. Hungry crane stands on one leg. Reach back. Hungry crane. Capture shrimp. Hungry crane. Capture shrimp. Good. Feet together. Yes, ma'am. All right. Let's do our life skill. The path of self mastery requires a creative spirit. A creative spirit has no self doubt. Path of self mastery requires a creative spirit. A creative spirit has no self doubt. The path of self mastery requires a creative spirit. A creative spirit has no self 